Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today, I will show you some methods to fix error code CE346328 on PS4. Method 1, Restore Licenses. Just go to Settings. Select Account Management. Select Restore License. Restoring your licenses may take several seconds to minutes, depending on the number of licenses you have in your internet connection. Once done, see if the error code CE346328 is fixed. Method 2. Create new local user and redownload the game. First, we need to delete the local user by go to settings. Go to login settings. Go to user management. Select delete user. Please, delete all user here. After that, create a new user and sign into your PSN account. And check if the problem is fixed. If the error code CE346328 still appears, then try delete and reinstall the game. Method 3, activate or reactivate as your primary PS4. Go to settings. Select account management. Go to activate as your primary PS4. If your account is not activated, then select activate. Otherwise, choose deactivate. After that, reactivate your account as your primary PS4, then check if error code CE346328 is gone. Method 4, Power Cycle the PS4 and Router. Turn off the router and PS4 then unplug them from the power outlet. Wait at least 3 minutes. After that, plug the router back into the power outlet, then it's time to power on the router. Continue. Plug the PS4 back into the power outlet, then restart the PS4. Wait for all panel lights on the router to become green on before testing your internet connection. Connect to the network with your PS4 and test the internet connection. It's always better to test this by connecting with an Ethernet cable if possible. Method 5. Rebuild Database. To do this, you have first to turn off your console by holding the power button for 3 seconds. The power indicator will blink for a few moments before turning off. Once the console is off, press and hold the power button again. Release it after you hear the second beep, one beep will sound when you first press, and another 7 seconds later.
Now, connect the controller with the USB cable. Now press the PS button on the controller. On the safe mode screen, select rebuild database. Select OK. Wait for the process to complete and restart your PS4 console. Most of the time, this method will help you to fix error code CE346328. Finally, if you still see this error, then initialize PS4, reinstall system software. This is a last resort but it may be necessary if the error is caused by a corrupted system file. Please refer to the video linked in the description if you don't know how to do this method. That's it guys, hope this is helpful. If you have any further questions, please feel free to get in touch or leave a comment. Thanks.